Very important game for both of these sides. They've lost only one match so far in the season. Four and one. The Cats and the Roos. Javon to the right in the first quarter. Chance for Armstrong to get clear. He didn't get very far. King down towards right half forward. That's as far as it's going. Carey chops it off. He's going to go across the ground. Well, the young guys found a free kick down to North Melbourne. Ronnie Burns was a the player there, interfered after the kick. Pete. Anderson kicks down towards centre half forward. Scholl got two hands to it, nearly ridden into the ground that he was. Bell hurried hand pass. Opportunity for Stevens, 48 metres out, goes at goal, looks pretty good, he's kicked it. A casual bounce, kicks it out in front, looking for Scholl, Simpson did well. Pickering, an outstanding midfield player, the Colbert to Hocking, under oh. pressure, oh, caught high, bang, down he goes. McKinnon gives him support, back to couch, the Brownlow medalist. The boy from Boggy Creek gets it across, Billy Prowlis to Ronnie Burns, should kick a goal, a bit of magic. Burns on a couch, both of whom have been busy so far in the first quarter. Martin in front of Brown, they should have taken the mark. Easy to say from up here. Brewer. Still he goes. A snap at goal, it bounces and it bounces through. He's kicked it. Fog. It certainly could be a factor later on. At the moment it's okay. Punch down by McKernan. Simpson. Quick hand pass. Armstrong again. Six goals, no behind so far. Three each. Archer keeps the record straight. North Melbourne's fourth. The Roos by six points. Well, Brownless last week at Cadinia Park was kickless in the first quarter, but he certainly made his presence felt after that kick, didn't he? Yes, he beat it three goals uh, in that second term. And Barnes Ooh. makes Ooh. a pretty good yeah. grab. Yeah. Yep. So 50 metres against Corey McKernan. Corey, no, it wasn't uh, the right way to finish off the piece of play, mate. John Barnes kicked two great goals last week against Richmond after starting on the interchange bench. Now, oh. it looks like McKernan may have been reported. So umpire Peter Carey has just notified him of such, uh, such an act and he pops through his first goal. The refrigerator has got it. Roberts. McKernan. Yes! Now, if he kicks this, it will certainly take away that sour taste in the mouth. And the way that he actually attacked the ball that time, and you could see the look on his face. That and There he is on screen now. He's got a few words to say, but he's pretty fired up. So a goal would regain the lead for North Melbourne by three points. He kicks and he goes north back in front. In front was Laidley. But North Melbourne coming again. Getting very dewy out there. Very hard for the players to gather it. Finally, Roberts. Good mark in front of Archer. Really make the most of the opportunities. Glenn Archer for his second. 20 metres out directly in front. And he kicks it first goal of the second quarter. Now a chance for Riccardi to gather it in. Gets clear of Simpson. Past Archer. Past McFarlane. Loose ball. Spooned up to Kilpatrick. McGrath. Straight down the centre of the ground for Brook. Cat setting something up here. Hocking. Looks for Riccardi going past on the run. Great long kick from Riccardi. Freeborn also on the bench. Again, it's a goal, the difference. Hall in front, outbodied by Simpson. Picked up by Matthew Armstrong. Goes for distance, finds Carey. Carey's at centre wing. Hasn't kicked a goal tonight so far. The Duck, been in defence a lot. In the first quarter, Scholl, he's kicked two behind. Craig Scholl, outside 50. Booming kick! Oh, look at that! What a kick! To Fairley. 
He'll go the boundary line, won't quite get there. Burns has snared it just inside. What's he going to do this time? You never know with this kid. He's got it to Billy Brown, this, but he's in a pretty hard position there, right on the boundary line in the pocket. And that's the angle facing Billy. Oh, oh, unbelievable. Very bad checking. Colbert directly in front. Would have to fall over to miss it. Oh, gee. He nearly did, but he kicked it. Young Sam McFarlane. Couldn't quite take it. Now North Melbourne. Oh, King intercepts well. Couch, 19 possessions in the first half. The Brownlow medalist. Down to Hocking. Oh, he's three times best and fairest winner of the Cats, an All-Australian, and that is a sensational grab. He's gone short, and once more, some slack checking. And Tenner runs in. He's going to kick the easiest of goals. Bad play, North Melbourne. Great play, the Cats. It's all Geelong down there in the last run of defence, and Shaw does the mopping up work, kicks it back well outside 50, low trajectory kick, falls to the advantage of Simpson, his hand pass taken by Bell, centering kick. Now a chance for Roberts off the pack, across his body, and kicks, and the fridge has dropped it. So Rock right on 50, it's one for the high flyers. So Wayne Carey, 10 metres out, kicks a goal. Nichols paddles it forward, comes up with a football, well played. Lost his strides, cheeky, Tudor. Now Scholl, clever handball, underground, intercepted by Kilpatrick. He gives it straight to Rock. Rock goes in towards full forward and Martin, Mickey Martin, has taken the mark. Well, let's see what sort of a kick and goal he is. Been a few years ago since he played under 19s, though, Peter. <laughs> They'd love him to kick this to Roo supporters. He might have sneaked it in. He has. It's a goal. The Cats won a thriller last week against the Tigers. It's a thriller again tonight. Tudor off to McGrath. Kicks the ball straight to centre half forward. Ronnie Burns in front has it punched away. Couch. It's been good all night. Beautiful kick by Couch. So it's a long bomb by John Barnes. It's 12 12, 84 apiece. Tipper's becoming a little bit frightened down there at ground level. Pickering gets hauled up. Free kick lately. No disputing that mark. Terry in front. 10 marks, Pete. Mongrel punt off the boot. But you could call it a perfect pass as Bell has grabbed it 25 metres out from goal. Good mark under the conditions. A very awkward kick to mark. He's been very busy, Peter Bell. I mean, uh, Shoal's been tied on him. He kicks. He likes it. And the goal umpire says, it's there. Lately, the junkyard dog. Just inside the boundary line. Kicks up towards centre wing. Shawley's target. Good mark over Simpson, who's legged him. And that's 50. North leading at the moment. 91 to 86. He increases their lead by one goal. He'll run to 50. Over the top. <laughs> Riccardi gives it across the Brewer. The Cats are back in it. Maybe too far out for him. 65 to 70 metres. He's really launched into that one. Marking contest in the goal square. Oh! oh! Has he kicked it? He has. Up towards half forward of the markers there. Rock has taken it. 65 metres out. And Colbert. Stims the fly, but there's the siren. A thriller at the MCG with North Melbourne victorious 15 14 104, defeating Geelong 13 15 93.